starting back and everyone clapped and jumped for joy no but i have online school it's wednesday i'm gonna bring you all on to the first week of online school with me and we're gonna see what subjects i'm doing this semester and then i'll update you at like the end of the semester let you know how i did in the courses paths failed uh, barely get through you know the thing I thought I could be a productive person, but I can't. My class is at 8 o'clock and I set an alarm for like 6 so that I can shower and do everything. But I think I'll just get up at 7. Good morning! Okay, so the situation that happened yesterday happened today again. So apparently, this class is supposed to start from the week of the 13th and today's the 8th. So, that class is supposed to be starting next week. Love this for me. So, my first classes actually start tomorrow. So, I'll see you tomorrow. But the class I had yesterday is being taught by the same person that I was supposed to have this morning. So when um, I saw that the class was supposed to start next week, I thought that that email was from was for the other class that I was supposed to have yesterday. Um, but I should have looked at the course code properly. I mean, that's what's happening when you don't read. So now I'm up at like 8 o'clock for no reason. A clown. That's clown shit. My next class is at... 10. Hopefully that one doesn't get cancelled because I will rip these boots out of my head. Um, the aesthetic like morning routine like that's not my brand. That's not no. I'm struggling. I'm tr really trying my best here. Um, but yeah, I'm at really glad that my school is online because imagine having to be there for eight o'clock. Please! Ghetto. I guess I ended up saying because if the class wasn't cancelled, I would not have gone to eat breakfast. And so I had time to do it now. So I'm going to eat this and then, I don't know, relax until 10 o'clock. Yeah, we'll see. Well, I really don't know how I feel about the upcoming school year because I've been hearing through the grapevine, I guess people that already had classes, they're saying that they aren't allowed to record lectures anymore, which is like, I mean, I get people like would skip classes and then it's online so people would be able to like cheat easier. But like for people that like me that are honest students, it makes life just so much harder. Like it just feels like they're trying their best to like want us to go back there. I don't want to go back. I like, I like my online school. I move at my own pace. I sit down and I rewatch lecturers to like go over stuff to like you know what i mean Ugh, it's just so so annoying but it is what it is i wore my um blackbird shirt you know in the spirit of school spirit <laughs> I don't know, I feel like this semester is going to be hard. I don't know, because I'm doing managerial economics, isn't that like, mathy? You know what I mean? Like, numbers and things. How am I going to do that without recording lectures? Because quantitative methods and, like, financial management that I did, I got A's in both of them. But that's only because I had recorded lectures. I went back and I rewatched and rewatched and, like, try to help myself, like, learn myself. You know what I mean? If they don't have that, then I have to depend on that one live lecture. Like, what if my computer cut out? Excuse me? You're telling me that I can't go back and rewatch it and be like, you know, this was glitching for like a solid 10 minutes. Let me go back and see what she was saying. You mean I can't do that? Ghetto. Huh. Anyways, we'll see though. We'll see.
we gotta turn our cameras on, guys. Okay, so I'm just waiting for some more of those cameras to come on before we get started with the course. And that would be more or less the standard for go, doing the course. It is, um, unfortunately, we have to have the course online and um, we do have to have a way of making sure that uh, you know you are there, you are present. Class is finished. Just thought I'd tell you guys. Um, it seems pretty interesting, even though we have to have our cameras on, uh, that's new. Ulysses is making life really hard for people, isn't it? Anyways, we have to have our cameras on to make sure that we're actually there and not going anywhere. Oh my god, I just realized somebody's cutting grass. Just ignore the noises, like, just ignore them. Let me try to go somewhere else. That may be less noisy. Nope, you get it, we're still here. We have to have our cameras on, blah, blah, blah. It's fine, I guess. The lady seems very nice. Um, even though I don't want my cameras on, I don't want people looking at me. But she started turning her cameras on, and I guess people wasn't prepared. Because it was only me and another girl who turned our cameras on. And then we had to, like, introduce ourselves, blah, 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 blah. So, creativity and innovation management seems pretty okay. But I hope the classroom is online, because I do not want to go up to UE. I really don't. But we'll see how it goes. <laughs> I'm in my parents' bed because their bed is better than mine. But um, the next time you see me, I might be looking a little busted and crusted because like I try to go to sleep right now. <laughs> my next class I have is at seven, I think. Yeah, my next class I have is at seven. So we'll see you then. I love the little woke up, y'all. I told y'all I was gonna look crusty. I didn't think it was set for that long. Um, I have a tutorial at 6 to 7, but like I said, no tutorials first week. So I have a lecture at 7 to 9. Yay, fun. Let's go. Well, this class that I have right now, Intro to Entrepreneurship, I don't know what I'm supposed to click to enter the, the Zoom. There's like a bunch of links and none of them have the time that the actual class is supposed to be starting at. So what? So my dear, time job is ready to look at business plans that persons will present for funding, whereas on evenings then I teach students are ready to complete the plans. Hi! Okay, so it is Friday. It is the next day. I forgot to um, tell you how my class went yesterday. It seems like, like it's going to be a fun class. We have group work, but I have a friend in my class. So that's great. I'm in my third year and all my friends are doing like different things to me. So I didn't expect that I would have somebody in my class. So that's fun. I'm looking forward to it. The lady seems nice. I'm just glad it feels good. So today I have managerial econ. So we'll see how that goes. I <laughs> woke up at like two o'clock this afternoon because I slept yesterday when I told you I was going to sleep. I went to sleep and I woke up at like after six. So I was out for a while, and then in the night time, I couldn't sleep. So, yeah, I was up for like kind of the whole night. I was up probably like after four this morning, and I woke up at two in the afternoon. My schedule is in shambles. I can't. But anyways, we're going to log into Managerial Econ, and we're going to see how this goes. So it's 4.55 right now. So let's go. Thank you. 
basically this course um, seeks to guide you as students towards applying microeconomic theory to practical problem solving, also making more informed management decisions supported by a quantitative, quantitative analysis. So we are going to have, um, especially, especially in the latter part of this course, a lot of quantitative stuff. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, you just can't get into the resources. In terms of the areas, the topics to be covered, and as I said, I might add an AF1. Finance and investment analysis. That this would be more of a qualitative type essay related um, approach to this topic. Oh. In, in which the French should adopt. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry right now. Hi. So it is the next week it is wednesday i forgot to tell my last class when it was fine i feel like if that's gonna be my um least favorite class though managerial economics because is managerial economics but the guy seems pretty chill everybody seems nice so far i forgot i had homework so i have this class at one to three and then i have to do a live on tiktok at seven so what i'm gonna do is okay the string's giving me the character energy like no okay, so what i'm gonna do is do my class at one to three from like three to seven i'm gonna do my homework i have managerial economics homework and it shouldn't be hard because it was the first class so it's just like basic questions and what was, what was the subject in is it intro to entrepreneurship I did that already. It is it's the same creativity and stuff, so I can't even get away with not doing it because I have to have my cameras on. So yeah, and also my mother's on the phone talking right now, so I'm gonna peace out. So I'm gonna tell you how it goes. I was like, y'all, this is the class. Remember the first time that I thought I had a class when I like get pushed the next week? This is this class. This class is production operations management. I don't know what I expect from the class, honestly, just, I don't know what to expect from any of the classes. For some of my older classes, I went and I looked for like past papers just to see like what kind of questions were being asked on like exams and stuff, just to try to get a sense of what the course is, but I didn't do that this semester. Guys, I got my oranges. Wait till let's see. Why is my dog going towards me? What? My oranges. Say hi. Okay. <laughs> he finally got here. Don't worry, it's Beijing time. Also, my computer sounds like it possessed. I don't know what's going on. You will see tutorial one. Study, prepare for class. I'm begging you, please come to tutorials prepared. Not the rain falling. Anyways, I keep forgetting to tell y'all in my class. Me. Say hi. I keep forgetting to tell y'all my class is finished, but it finished. Um, yeah. It, it seems like it was gonna be a good class, very interesting. He mentioned some quantitative stuff. I don't like that. Like, I don't like the numbers, y'all. I, I don't, I don't like that. No. But it still seems like it was gonna be a, a, a okay class. We'll see how it goes.
right y'all so today we have business strategy and policy i don't know what to expect with this class it just sounds like a lot of reading um which is always one of my favorites because it's if it's just reading it's just reading you know what i mean the calculations and the all the, but like reading like all you have to do is read we'll see and this will be the first week of my classes. Well, this is technically the second week, but these are just the classes that are like my first class. So, yeah. This character wants to be character so bad. This is my channel, though. Morning. How is everybody Morning. doing? Great. Okay, so welcome to the session, folks. Um, so today, good. normally our first day, we do um, housekeeping stuff. Then, uh, so the first thing I want to do is to do our introduction. And this is really going to be giving you some background information on the course. Oh, he introduced and, the course. And uh, I believe he all of you would have used Collaborate this. before. So you know you want to say it requires application that you read models and new concepts and you apply those concepts. I told you and you have to practice their number. You have to develop a number of tools and analyze those tools. So that's where you need to practice and dedication from week one. Picture mm -hmm. of a semester is this dedication. Spring, right? I don't know if any for five or six member group for the oral case, but for the simulation, there will be a, a group.